Hey guys, Asher here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be doing Starved Nikocado Avocado. Now, before this video starts, I would just like to say this, that this video is completely satire, um, just in case people actually get annoyed, but then again, it is a Nikocado Avocado, av avocado meat um, starved character, so you could probably guess it's satire. Um, yeah, so, tomorrow I might do a Sonic OC, or I might do a backstory for another Sonic character, or I might make Sunky fight everybody. Let me, on the, let me know on the Discord server, I'll link it down below. I'll probably post a poll on the channel anyway, so you need to be subscribed for that. But, uh, yeah, anyway, on with the video. It was a normal Monday, Nikocado Avocado was going to make his daily mukbang when he realised he barely had any food. So he decided to do a special mukbang. Now Nikocado sat down and pressed record on his camera. The mukbang was strange, to say the least. You see, Nikocado had gone out and bought a bunch of dead bugs and soon started eating them for the mukbang. But then it got interesting. A fly was buzzing around Nick, so he grabbed it. He looked at it for a few seconds as if contemplating something. And he put the fly in his mouth and chewed. After Nick uploaded the video, it went viral, raking in 5 million views in 12 hours. People seemed to like the fact that Nick would eat anything he could get, he could get his hands on, so he decided to up it for each video. Next video he did, he would eat a small bird, 7 million views. Next he ate a large animal such as a fox or a dog or a cat, 15 million views. Next he ate a cow alive, 75 million views. So for his next video, he decided he would do something big. So later that night, he called Orlin and asked him if he could come over. Orlin agreed. A few hours later, Orlin arrived at Nick's apartment and asked, Nick, I'm here. What do you need me for? Orlin got a reply in the form of a shovel to the back of his head, knocking him out. Orlin soon awoke to himself tied to a table and Nick doing his usual intro. Hello, today we're going to be trying Orlin. And with that, Nick pulled out a large knife. As he swung it down, Orlin turned and the knife struck the struck the ropes causing Orlin to free himself. Orlin soon bolted out the door and into Nick's living room, grabbing a revolver. Orlin was about to get up when he was grabbed by Nick and thrown back into the mukbang room. Nick stalked toward him and said, I can't have my food getting taken away so soon, can I? And with that, Nick swung his hand downward towards Orlin, but Orlin put his hands up in self-defense, causing one of his fingers to come off. Orlin screamed in pain. And in his rage, he shouted, You bastard! and fired the, revol the revolver, getting the only bullet in the gun to hit Nick, stunning him. Orlin took the chance to run away. He burst out into the alley and was about to reach daylight when he got a knife through the leg. Orlin tripped over and crawled towards the end of the hallway. As he was about to get to the end, his leg was grabbed and he was pulled back into the darkness, never to be seen again.